You want to learn how to do page setup automatically in AutoCAD? Keep watching. Hi, welcome to a new video on AutoCAD macros for automatic drawings. Today, I'll share with you how to do automatic page setup in layout in AutoCAD. But first, let's briefly explain what page setup are and how do they work and also why do you need it. So as you can see, this is page setup manager. Here you're gonna set up all of the printing settings for your specific drawing. So you will need this to do plot preview in AutoCAD. As you can see, this is this has the correct, the incorrect page setup. And also you'll need it to do a batch plot or publish in AutoCAD. This is where you print multiple drawings at once. So to access or start working in page setup, you click on the layout tab and choose page setup manager. Here you gonna modify your page setup by clicking modify tab and choose the correct settings for your specific drawing. In this case I'm gonna do a PDF and the paper size is gonna be 24 by 36 I'll choose extend and always center the plot uh, scale as line weights sorry and that's my plot style I'll pick the following settings and scale line weights always I wanna make sure this is correct so I'll do a preview and as you can see the preview looks correct I'll click OK as you can see I modified the plot or page setup for this drawing now if I do a plot preview this will look correct as it's supposed to look so now that you understand AutoCAD page setups I'm gonna undo and show you how to do page setup automatically in a layout in AutoCAD using the lazy page setup command you click on it and as you can see my page setup was automatically done and as you can see if I type F2 you can see all of the steps that we did with a single click So to do this command, let's type CUI and press enter. Here you're gonna create a brand new AutoCAD command. So click the start icon to create a new command. Then choose the name for your new command. Try to be specific here as you might want to create two or three page setups that you normally use. So I'll type in 24 by 36 for my sheet size and this is going to be a PDF. On the macro section, type in the following macro, but wait, don't panic. I'll simplify this for you. So what about this? Better now. So here you're going to type in your printer or plotter your paper size and the plot style name your drawing orientation if it's landscape or portrait your paper units if it's inches or millimeters to make your life easier i'll post this code on one of my social media platforms so you can easily copy and paste and create your new command however I won't tell you in which one because you are following all of them correct 
The last step is to create a new icon for your new command. So simply click your new command and choose one of the icons available in AutoCAD. Then click edit and choose the color for your new and choose the color you want to use. Finally, hold left click on your mouse and start drawing the correct size for your page setup sheet. Save the image and choose a name for it. Finally, click OK and close. Now you need to left click on your mouse and drag your new command to your quick access panel so you have it available anytime. Finally, click apply and OK. So now to test your new command, undo and click your new lazy page setup command. Awesome. And this is the benefit of using automatic page setup command in AutoCAD. You can do page setup in all of your drawings with a single click. If you are serious about saving time in AutoCAD, don't forget to subscribe and grab your 5 automatic commands while they are still available. You grab them at the link below this video. I'll see you here next week.